Hi, little readers. I am Stephen Nobles, and welcome to the first episode of Stories with Mr. Stephen. How many of you know the story of Humpty Dumpty? We all know he sat on the wall. We all know he had a great fall. But what happened after he hit the ground? Well, today, I am going to read After the Great Fall. Are you guys ready? Let's get started. After the Great Fall, How Humpty Dumpty Got Back Up Again, a story by Dan Santak. My name is Humpty Dumpty. This was my favorite spot high on the wall. I know it's an odd place for an egg to be, but I loved being close to the birds. Then one day I fell. I'm sort of famous for that part. Folks called it the Grand Fall which sounds a little grand. It was just an accident, but it changed my life. Fortunately, all the king's men managed to put me back together. Well, most of me. There were some parts that couldn't be healed with bandages and glue. After that day, I became so afraid of heights I was so scared that it kept me from enjoying some of my favorite things. I walked past that wall every day and I would think about climbing the ladder again. I really missed the birds and being high above the city, but I could never do it because I knew that accidents can happen. I eventually settled for watching the birds from the ground. It wasn't the same, but it was better than nothing. Then one day, an idea flew by. Making planes was harder than I thought. It was easy to get cuts and scratches. But day after day, I kept trying and trying. until I got it right. My plane was perfect and it flew like nothing could stop it. I hadn't felt this happy in a long time. It wasn't the same as being in the sky with the birds, but it was close enough. Unfortunately, accidents happen. They always do. I almost walked away again, but then I thought about the time I spent working on my plane and all the other things I'd missed. I decided I was going to climb that wall, but the higher I got, the more nervous I felt. I didn't want to admit it. I was terrified. I didn't look up, I didn't look down, I just kept climbing one step at a time. Until I was no longer afraid. Maybe now you won't think of me as the egg who's famous for falling, crack, crack. Hopefully you'll remember me as the egg that got back up. The egg that got back up learned how to fly. The end. I hope you guys enjoyed that story. And I'll see you next time for our next episode of Stories with Mr. Steven. Thank you.